My last ever stitch fix. What a sad day. I used to get stitch fixes quite regularly back in the day after I had my son. That was about, well, about three years ago, I'd say. So here we are today. And if you didn't know, stitch fix are actually closing the doors to their UK market. I think at the end of October or sometime in October. So I had £10 credit remaining. So I thought to myself, let's use that credit. Let's get my final Stitch Fix box. And fingers crossed there are some gems in there. I don't really want to be sending things back um, when they're closing down. And if this is the first time you have clicked on my videos, hello, my name is Caroline. I am a mum of two little ones and I post all types of content on my channel, range from lifestyle, food stuff, because we're a vegan family, everything and anything, to be honest, I post it all. I haven't got a specific thing. So that sounds like something that you're interested in if you'd like to see what we get up to on a regular basis please do hit that subscribe button also the most important thing I completely forgot to mention we're going to Disneyland California in the next couple of weeks so make sure you hit that subscribe button because you don't want to miss those vlogs because I cannot wait it's going to be so much fun um, so yeah right without further ado let's get into my stitch fix if you didn't know what stitch fix was it is a or was a <laughs> um, personal stylist postal service which is a great idea so basically I think you get sent five items I can't remember now it's been so long since I had my last box you send get sent five items and then you can try them on and if you like any of them you keep them and you pay the personal stylist the stitch fix for the item um, and if you don't like the item you can just send it right back to them obviously during covid times this was a godsend because you couldn't go out to the shops so it's great to have a little closed parcel delivered to your door but now covid has gone i assume maybe people are now just going to the shops instead i have had some gems from stitch fix in the past some some awful boxes i'm not gonna lie have had some bad ones um and i completely forgot they existed to be honest but let's get in there last thing i'll say you can request your personal stylist before your box arrives for some items in particular that you were looking for so and i don't know because they are closing down i'm not sure how much they look to the list so we'll see we'll see when i get in the box but i only ask for t-shirts because all i need at the minute is bright colorful t-shirts i don't need dresses i don't need any workwear because obviously i don't work in an office anymore and so i'm really had i don't want jeans uh, so i would literally said i only want colorful t-shirts so i'm or sparkly t-shirts so i'm really hoping that they have paid attention to that because you usually get like a little or you used to get a little rundown of the items they were going to send you so you could veto them before they got sent to you because obviously sometimes they're going to send you something you definitely don't one and their, their aim is for you to keep all five items um we do keep all five, five items i believe now because they're closing if you keep all five items you get quite a substantial discount so i'm hoping that i can do that i'm hoping i can keep all five items um so yeah i didn't get the clothes rundown before this box was sent to me again i'm not sure if that's because they're closing and maybe they're just they're just like get the clothes out of here we don't want it in our warehouse anymore so without further ado i've just opened the thing let's open it please colorful clothes please please first item is that's not t-shirts it's a pair of jeans i didn't want this this is the reason stitch fix oh my gosh trousers oh god's sake it's got a little thingamajiggy in there usually they give you like a little rundown of what you get as a parting gift and thank you for your continu continued loyalty you'll receive a 70 percent discount when you keep all five items in your fix and a 50 percent discount when you keep up to four items okay so that's that's the the deal they have at the minute because they're closing down but oh i asked for colorful t-shirts and i've got a pair of trousers so as you can tell, I'm not thrilled. I'm already annoyed, so that's not a good start. So that's that there. Well, maybe I'll like them, I don't know. I don't, they're just, oh, I'll try them on. I just, oh, two colorful t-shirts. I really have an idea. Oh, this is like something that, no, oh, this is absolutely not. I'm annoyed, I'm really annoyed. This is awful. That is one of the ugliest things I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh my goodness, this is something that I'm not going to wear this. I for colourful t-shirts and they give me a spotty blue blouse. I don't want this. This is awful. <laughs> I could cry. I'm so bummed out. I was really looking forward to this box. They give me two navy items, first of all. That's obviously never going to work together as an outfit. What are they thinking? I think they're just, I think they're just trying to shift the items and have a look to what you've asked for not a good advert oh we've got a t-shirt in packaging okay i do like stripes so i'll give them that 
crew clothing not a long sleeve t-shirt this is the worst box i've ever received in my entire life i didn't want to send anything back and i'm already 100 percent sending this thing back and now we've got a long sleeve top i don't want a long sleeve top i cannot believe it I cannot believe it. I do like stripes, but I don't like long sleeved clothes because they irritate me. I don't understand the point of long sleeve stuff. I'd rather wear a t-shirt and a jumper. This is a catastrophe. What's next? Oh, another horrible item. Another blouse. Why? What are they thinking? They, they, I don't think they're paying any attention whatsoever. This is the... Actually, I take it back. This is the ugliest top I've ever seen. Let's just have a look, see. What on earth is that? That is not a nice, colourful top. That is something that my grandma used to wear. No offence if you've decided that you've got this and you like it, but the, my grandma would wear this. May she rest in peace. <laughs> this is horrid. That is horrid. Honestly, what is going on? And the last item, another pair of trousers. This is the worst box I've ever received in my entire life. The exact same pair of trousers, but in green. The exact same pair of trousers, but in green. If this is an advert for not spending any money on Stitch Fix, this is the advert, because they clearly do not care. I can't believe <laughs> <laughs> this is awful 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 they haven't looked at my little request thing i am annoyed i'm gonna try them on for you help me it fits okay okay i'm not gonna it fits okay but it's just so ugly why are they dressing me like this i am in my 30s and i don't know anyone who would ever wear something like this. It's meant to be like a personal stylist. This is not something that someone who wants to be stylish would wear. And I am sorry if you have received this and you like it. This is my opinion, but I don't like this at all. And these are the trousers. They fit okay. I mean, they're a little bit roomy, but that's probably better than being too tight. But my issue is, right, this is like, so the top part I don't think is too bad. How am I going to show you the bottom bit? It's like a weird flare. How can I show this to you? I'm going to go downstairs and show, I'll get my, show my husband's reaction to this outfit and then I'll ask him to show me, show you the whole thing. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not awful. Do you love it? Isn't it awful? I honestly thought you were wearing the thickest of coats coming down the stairs. It's actually the sound of those trousers. <laughs> Look at that. At least I'm a foot so off the floor. Annoyed. What age did you put? 50 plus? <laughs> Honestly, I thought they've just gone through. They've just gone through <laughs> and just gone through like they've just got their warehouse. So it's like that'll do, that'll do, that'll do. Colourful t shirts. This is a colourful. And the other option That's is. It's like more of a blouse, isn't it? Yeah, I've got another blouse which is polka dot with, uh, with this same colour with white polka dots. <laughs> oh Christ. Good, eh? If I keep all the items, I get 50% off. Ah, and what if you burn them all? <laughs> the other top here is definitely too big for my small boobs, which I think are going smaller now. I think now breastfeeding is starting to slow down. I think they're getting smaller, which is a sad day. <laughs> um, yeah. Be good if you're like on maternity. It definitely has like room to grow. But other than that, <laughs> this is a size 10 and it is so tight around the arms. <laughs> wow, that is absolutely not a size 10. <laughs> no way is that a size 10. I'm gonna rip it by twisting it around. <laughs> That's a that's that one in. <laughs> this one I did consider briefly before I put it on. I considered maybe buying this one if the price of it is like, I don't know, fairly cheap, and if it's like 50% or 70% or whatever on earth the discount is, maybe it'd be worth it. But as I can barely get it on my arms, uh, and go.
because I think that's going to be a no and also it's just like it feels, yes, yeah, it doesn't fit properly even though it says size 10 and I am size 8 to 10 so there's no reason why this shouldn't fit me properly so what a flop. Usually the box comes with like a price list but I believe they put everything on the website so let me have a quick look and see if I can find the price of everything on their webby sitey. I'll go through so it says Paula G was my stylist who didn't look at what I asked for thank you for shopping our closure sale we hope you enjoy your items in your fix you'll receive a 70% discount when you keep all five items in your fix and a 50% discount when you keep up to four items discount applied at checkout thank you so my items and this is the thing with this box the two blouses are from the same brand Daniel Rain whatever that means uh, the two pairs of trousers are from the brand Mavi and then this top here is from Crew Clothing and this highlights more to me they're just using things that they've just got lying around because they would never usually send things from the same company especially how the trousers are literally the same apart from the cut off at the bottom and the blouses are again pretty much the same you don't send someone two blouses do you so let's see how much everything co cost this blouse here with the polka dots 51 pounds there's no way there's no way that anyone, anyone who even likes that would pay £51. Like, come on, £51 for a blouse? Never, never, ever, ever. And then the other blouse here, this one, I assume it's going to be £51 as well. She's the other one's 45 I don't, why? <laughs> Sheila cropped trousers, the blue trousers, uh, £69. I just don't get it. I just don't get it. And then the second pair of trousers, these khaki ones are again £69. And then this top here is £29. Did this fix feel personalised to you? No. Are you satisfied with this fix? No. Does this fix match your style? No. But the total of all the items before any sort of discount or anything would have been £263 for all the items in the box, which is insanity to me. That is so much money. Um, I don't know how to do maths, so hey, hey Google. What's 70% of 263? The answer is 184.1. Hey Google, what's 263 184.1? The answer is 78. So, the, so if I wanted to keep everything in this box with the 70% discount they would give me, it would only, I think, if my maths are right, I can't figure out if my maths are right, I think the total would be 78, 78 pounds, which is such a good deal. I think that's incredible, 70% off the box. If you are actually getting it for 78 pounds, then I think that's an absolute bargain. It's just a shame that absolutely everything in this box was horrific um, for me, so... I was I was prepared to go a little bit off piste if some of the items had been a bit weird but I might have just kept them but all of the items are so ugly I will never wear them and it just seems a bit pointless to even attempt to keep them because what am I going to do them I'm not going to sell them are you mad um so yeah I'm a little bit miffed to say the least everything's going back and that will be my last ever stitch fix so we're, we're ending it on a negative but it is what it is um yeah <sighs> what do you think well, am i being dramatic i don't think i am i'm not being dramatic all the items are rubbish aren't they i do like i have to say i do like the quality of these trousers they do fit quite nicely around the waist but the, the way the legs end i just thought i mean they just look really odd and they look like i'm just too tall for them and yeah it's not for me anywho that's that um that's my stitch fix haul i hope you've enjoyed this catastrophic video <sighs> like i said i'm going to disney soon to so hit subscribe and come follow me when i go to disney instead of following me for rubbish stitch fix hauls and i will see you in my next one goodbye